Radiation checks at Japanese factories have become standard operating procedure in the wake of the crisis at the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant, with automakers looking to ensure 100% safety for staff and consumers. Nissan, the first Japanese automaker to implement such testing in March, carries out its checks before any shipment. At Nissan's Opama factory, southwest of its Yokohama headquarters, a sample number of cars in each shipment are consistently screened, with all radiation readings to date well within safety levels. Measurements carried out at Opama and at the shipping port of Honmoku near Nissan's headquarters are recorded in microsieverts and taken from the center of car hoods, wheel housing units, and near the steering wheel. えっと、弊社ではですね、ま、震災後3月18日から受注的に測定はしてました。で、その後、え、4月の12日にですね、自公開から測定のガイドラインというのが出まして、今はそれに従って測定を継続していると。いうことになります。The Japan Automobile Manufacturers Association said this week that radiation levels recorded around production sites and ports in Japan are not a threat to human health, falling within ranges designated by the Nuclear Safety Commission of Japan as well as the International Atomic Energy Agency. Nissan Corporate Vice President Simon Spruill says the checks are aimed at ensuring consumer safety and peace of mind. We recognize that we're in a period of great uncertainty at the moment, so our priority is the safety and the peace of mind of our customers, and that's why we're carrying out these checks on our cars at our ports before we export them. With much of Japan's auto production for export, the nation's Ministry of Economy, Trade and Industry has said there have been no international suspensions or restrictions on any vehicles shipped from the country, with more cars leaving ports every day.